All right, welcome to uh, Baraboo Thels, KDLL. -L. Ready for the uh, Paladins Simbancha Oshkosh um, event. Flight plan has been loaded into the uh, well, the flight plan. Page. <laughs> we have been fueled. See type frequency here on COM one. Then approach uh, Oshkosh approach uh, on uh, or the Fisk approach <clears throat> on uh, standby. Oshkosh Aetis here on COM two. I don't think we can hear it yet. No. Oscar Tower South here on standby. Once airborne, I will switch COM1 over and change that to um, 1185 uh, Tower North. So, 1800 feet set. We'll be doing uh, 90 knots, 1800 feet. We can uh, easily do that in the diamond. Already a good amount of airplanes already in the, in the air, as you can see here. So, um, yeah, I do have the uh, Pilot Edge Simventure notice up here as well uh, on my other monitor, just for reference. So, um, yeah, without further ado, let's uh, go uh, go to Oshkosh. Baraboo traffic, Diamond 4 to 6, Yankee Papa is departing runway 1, Baraboo. How was that? As per life in the green. All these signs, man. <laughs> Rotate. Tap the brakes, gear up. Eighteen hundred feet. It's quick. It is this one two five nine, which I have set. Yeah. Might not be able to hear it yet. Okay, and we are flying the state ninety four here, which is uh, also shown on the iPad. Full flight. They want us to do the uh, Green Lake transition, so uh, Green Lake. This transition starts at the southwest corner of Green Lake. Proceed single file from southwest corner of Green Lake to the city of Ribbon, then Fisk via the railroad tracks. Remain half mile in trail of the aircraft you're following. Uh, yeah. So down, less than 30 knots. Exit to the right. Into the grass, and then make a hard right and take the north out in the grass. Down. Taxi to parking, follow the flag men until you see signs for parking. Then follow the parking signs. Yeah. And, uh, if we are doing runway 27, then after landing and when speed permits, all aircraft I require to exit 27 to the right. Okay, so big two. Both are to the right. Do not exit onto a taxiway as that takes too much time. Okay, we are extending the flaps. I want nice to have flaps engine. out Switch and uh, do 132 nice here on the load to maintain uh, 90 knots. Okay, so uh, one guy behind us and uh, a lot of us, a lot ahead of us. 
We have them here as well on the traffic picture. The track here looks like a good job. Nice job. Nice single file line coming right up the track. It's looking real good. Everybody's doing a great job. So uh, we're excited. Uh, excited the flaps just. Um, okay, you got a white to have one here. Half mile southwest of this. Start a right turn going to the east road. We're in that east road for only one eight right. It looks high up there. Maybe 2300. Or maybe higher. Who knows? Yeah, guy behind us there. Hello. Oh, that craft in that last half there. Runway 27, runway 18, right? Another stage is 20 and 21. So it looks like we are in front on my own line here, <clears throat> but the more aircraft up, probably up here. We are going to pick you out back on the within a mile of this. You're further than a mile out. I'm definitely not talking. There's the silos, probably railroad trucks there. I believe. Yeah, but could very well be my railroad tracks. All right. Excellent job on the rock for the Duchess Monitor Town, woman 8.5, and welcome to the show. All right, silo. Railroad tracks. What are the railroad tracks? All aircraft in Mandosh, Cross Lane, Union 271, one year bank. Ribba. Half mile trail spacing over the tracks from Ripon to Fisk, 1,890 knots. If you're unable to that, I need you at 2,335 knots. Within a mile of Fisk, we will pick you up by color and type. And I can't stress enough that if you are more than a mile from Fisk, I guarantee you I am not talking to you. Okay. Nice job, Comanche. Nice job on that one. My return now, woman 8.5. All right. Get it closer and closer. Hmm. It's getting exciting now. So we see the um, smokestacks. White to die hot at Mile South West of Paris. Turn right, join the east west road from runway 18 right. Okay, my white sky hot just about over Paris. Start that right turn, give me a hard right turn. Now white sky walk. Sky hot. Looks like Alpha Yankee and Alpha Yankee. Right turn, join that east west road. Sky hot. Hello, talk to me. You want uh, 733 Alpha Yankee? Go to 18. Yes, sir. Hard right turn now. Give me to pick up that east west road for you. Hard right turn. Pick up the east west road for runway one eight right. Thank you. Uh, Alpha right. Yankee, nice job on that. Monday Tower now with one two six point six. Welcome to the show. All right. <sighs> Lots of planes over there. Miracle. Alright, I'm getting very close. <clears throat> I ran by Don Scott. She's landing runways 27 and 18 right. Notice page is 20 and 21. Need your half mile trail spacing, 1890 knots. If unable to do that, need your 2335 knots. Definitely no side by side. It will not work. Find somebody of similar type and characteristics. Call them. Make sure you maintain that half mile right over the tracks from ready to fish. I will pick you up by calling type within a mile from fish. If you are further than a mile from this, I am definitely guaranteed 100% for sure not talking to you. All right, here we go. Okay, you got a red diamond, red diamond. You're leaving the pack here. You have a runway preference? One eight. Oh, red diamond, give me that right turn. It's right into the red turn. A oh, right turn, not red turn. You're red. Right turn, pick up that east west road for runway one eight right. Uh, 
for the diamond. Nice job. Monica Chow, 126.6. Welcome to the show. Hey, Jeff. Hey, Jeff. Hey, Jeff. You're clear to land on or after the pink dot. Everybody that lands runway 18 right, it'll be a right turn into the grass to follow the flagman. Welcome to SimVenture 2024. I hope you guys are having fun on day two. Absolutely, man. Oof. Are any of you guys okay. flying into the Fisk real uh, air venture? No, sadly not. If you were, this is a great way to get ready for it. Okay, we're my uh, one eight right. We're page two. Wait, Black one. Skyline, start that left base turn now. Start that left base turn now. Left base turn all the way around, all the way around. Do not go too far north. Don't want to scare the two seven arrivals. Beautiful job. Clear to land on or after the pink dot. Right turn into the grass. Do not taxi past the purple dot because you won't have much runway or any place to exit. White sky, uh, Skyhawk, that's coming up midfield left downwind. Same for you. Be established on the left base to beam the blue dot or air traffic mm -hmm. control tower, yeah. which is a bigger reference point. Clear to land on or after the pink dot with a right turn into the grass. All right, we have Oshkosh and an, a departure. All right, we just got notice uh, if anybody's on my frequency and you're going to go back out. Uh, for another arrival. We're now starting the uh, arrival point at Puckaway Lake. Puckaway transition now due to saturation. So after you depart, once you land and depart again, we're going to start at Puckaway Lake. Puckaway Lake. I've got a red and gray diamond just inside the interstate, left down on runway 18 right. Do not start your descent until you enter the left down on runway 18 right. Make sure that. Uh, Yep. Watch for the uh, departures coming off yeah, the runway 18 left, there. which is why I need you at 1,800 feet until you turn left down on runway 18 right. Uh, purple Cessna just over the uh, interstate. How about a wing rock on you? Okay. Yeah, I can do get on. Nice job for the purple Cessna. Uh, again, left downwind for runway 18 right, 1,800 feet. Do not start that descent until you turn left down when we've got a lot of departures coming off of runway 18 left. Uh, the red and gray diamond, again, left down on runway 18 right, clear to land on or after the pink dot. Make sure you're established on the left base. A beam the blue dot or better reference point is the air traffic control tower. So that red and gray diamond, start that left turn. There you go, left turn. Now you can also start your descent. Excellent. Purple Cessna, that's just south of the runways. You're following the uh, red and gray feet. diamond ahead of you, wing up left downwind. Reference point is uh, the uh, control tower. As a reminder, all aircraft coming inbound from 5th directly over the east-west road, I need you guys at 1,800 feet, no lower. We have a lot of departures that are coming off of runway 18 left. I don't need you to scare them. So that's why I need you at 1,800 feet until you enter the left down on runway 18 right. I'll pick you out about a half mile southwest of the field by type and color, give you instructions from there. Again, only landing runway 18 right today. Uh, it'll be on or after the blue oh, dot man. or the pink Oof. dot with the right turn into the grass. Uh, everybody needs to be established on a left base, a beam the blue dot, or even a better reference point. The big reference point is the air traffic control tower. If you go too far north, we start scaring the arrivals on 27, and we don't want to do that. Red and right. silver, or silver and red Cherokee type, uh, just inside the interstate rocket wings. Nice wing rock on you again, 1,800 feet until you uh, enter the left downwind. That's where you can start your descent. I'll give you instructions after you get midfield downwind. Red and gray diamond, you're looking really good all the way around. Clear to land on or after the pink dot. Purple Cessna midfield left downwind. Again, be established on that left base. The beam the blue dot. Clear to land on or after the pink dot. For my silver and red Comanche just south of the runways, uh, you can start that left down one turn in your left descent. Mm -hmm. 
Wind is calm, altimeter 29 or 9 or 2. Once you land, follow the flag into parking or back to a runway. If you're going to come back in, again, we are now starting the arrival at Puckaway Lake. So Puckaway transition, landing runway 18 right and runway 27. Little Ford under the left down in runway 18 right, report a mile southwest, or correction, southeast. Okay, we need to White taxi here. White blue command, you cross the interstate. Good, uh, how about a good wing rock on you? There you go. Maintain 1,800 feet until you uh, turn the left downwind. That's where you can start your descent. I'll give you instructions uh, about midfield left downwind. <laughs> oh, man, this is pretty cool. Little Ford, I'm going to have you follow Comanche. That's uh, just turning the left downwind now off your left hand side. And a little forward if you can, start a left turn now to kind of bring in your downwind a little bit to follow. White Cherokee just entering the left downwind, you're following the little forward just inside the uh, shoreline. He's about your 12 o'clock right now, approaching a left base runway 18 right. Uh, white and blue uh, Cherokee type, turn left now, left turn now for that left base. Left turn now all the way around, white and blue Cherokee. I need you to left turn all the way around, clear to land on or after the pink dot. Little forward runway 18 right, you're clear to land on or after the blue dot. White Cherokee midfield left down and you're flying little forward on the left base runway 18 right. Uh, you might need to square off that base a little bit for me. You're flying really good, so continue inbound. Be established on that left base beam the blue dot. Uh, white and blue Comanche just uh, south of the runways, 1,800 feet left down on runway 18 right. Don't start your descent until you enter the left downwind. White and black sky lane that's uh, in just past the interstate. Continue 1,800 feet left down on runway 18 right. You're flying a Comanche just ahead and to your left. White and black sky lane, I can need you to kind of fly to the northeast just a little bit. You're going to south of the interstate. Uh, white Cherokee, three Tango Sierra, you're looking really good. Runway 18 right, you're clear to land. Welcome to Oshkosh. <laughs> wow. Oshkosh, ATIS information echo. Wind calm, visibility 10. Sky clear, altimeter 292. VFR arrival and departure procedures in effect. Arriving runway 27 and runway 18 right. Pages 20 or 21 of the notice. Departing runway 18 left. Aircraft inbound for the Fisk arrival, proceed to Puckaway Lake to join the Fisk arrival. Arriving aircraft must be familiar with runway exit procedures. Refer to the bottom of pages 20 or 21 for your specific runway's exit procedure after landing. Upon arrival, pilots wishing to depart immediately shall follow the flagman. They'll guide you back to the runway for takeoff. Pilots wishing to taxi to parking shall follow the flagman until they see signage for parking. All Oshkosh departures refer to the departure procedures on page 23 of notice. Pull out of the designated parking area and follow the flagman to runway 18 left. Monitor tower on 118.9 be listening and ready to go upon reaching the runway. All pilots must set their simulators to VFR weather conditions with calm wind. Aircraft that are outbound for runway 18 left, note on page 24. We do have a display threshold, so you're actually going to taxi down that threshold until you get to the actual threshold of runway 18 left. So don't stop up there at the beginning of the runway. We want to keep taxiing down that threshold or that display threshold until you get to the threshold of runway 18 left. You'll see a cart over on the left-hand side, and that cart's got the controllers up on it. That's going to also denote where your threshold is. And this looks like another Mooney. I'll just have you stop right here at the threshold for me for a second. There we go. The other one's getting airborne now. And for zero Delta, runway 18 left, clear for takeoff. Runway okay. ahead for me out of the 1,300 until outside of the Delta. And that's for four zero Delta. There you go. Okay, we are taking back for um, departure here in Oshkosh at the SimVenture 2024 event. Currently, runway 18 left is uh, the departing runway. There's a change in that old time, so we are doing um, runway heading at 1300 feet until leaving. Little forward, runway 18 left, let's take the off. The class Delta airspace. <laughs> Oh, 
All right. And Baron 262, runway 18 left, there's four takeoff. Again, runway heading, runway heading out of below 1,300 and so outside of the Delta. Thanks for coming. 1,300 feet, runway 18 left, heading 180, looking good. Again, as you're taxiing out the runway 18 left for departure, you're going to taxi down to the display threshold and see the actual threshold. You'll also see a cart over on your left-hand side with some folks standing in front of it. That's where the controller should be. As you get close to that, I'll take you out by typing follow, or if I can see a call sign, I'm going to try to use that. It makes it less confusing. Everybody's going to fly runway heading today, not that 150 heading, but runway heading. You see, I've got an RV, red RV, runway 18 left. You are clear for takeoff. Again, everybody's flying runway heading. It'll be below 1,300 until outside of the class delta. And Cessna 7 Papa Fox Trot, runway 18 left, you are cleared for takeoff. Again, runway heading at or below 1,300. And that's a card with the uh, ACC or departure. Give them a little wave. Hello. Hi. Hi, it looks like I've got a diamond. Diamond uh, 6 Shanky Papa, runway 18 left, you are cleared for takeoff. And runway heading at or below 1,300 until outside of the dome. So thanks for coming. Again, those that are taxiing out for runway 18 left are going to taxi all the way down that display threshold and you see a cart over on the left hand side with some controllers standing out in front of it and that'll be the actual threshold for runway 18 left thirteen hundred feet just to um normal speed i guess looks like uh, the guys ahead of us are doing normal speed we are <clears throat> currently uh, still within the class delta airspace of Oshkosh. So, okay, we have a uh, green lake radio descending back down to uh, 1800 feet and we'll do set speed before entering. Okay, silo here, so let's. Turn. Follow the railroad tracks. Okay, smokestacks. So, so we finally have an RV-10 in the line today. Um, over fist, rock your wings. Nice rock for the RV. Right turn eastbound, follow the east-west road, runway 18 right for you. Plant a left downwind and monitor tower on 126.2. Welcome to Oshkosh. That Cessna I talked to earlier, you can continue over the the railroad tracks right downwind runway 27. Make your downwind inside the gravel pit and monitor tower on 118.5. Welcome to Oshkosh. RV half mile southwest of Fisk, crack your wings. Nice rock for the RV, 18 right for you. Turn right heading 090, follow the east west road. You can plan a left downwind to 18 right and monitor tower 126.2. Welcome to Oshkosh. Is that 126.2 or 126.2? Uh, 126. Point, uh, I'm sorry, I've been saying it wrong all along. 126.6, thank you very much. All right, here we go. All right, we got a diamond. Uh, looks like it's a twin diamond approaching fist rock your wing. All right, one diamond. I got two of you out there rocking. We got a twin diamond and archer. The twin diamond, I want you to continue on railroad tracks. Follow the uh, railroad tracks right downwind runway 27. Archer over Fisk, right turn, follow the east-west road, and you can plan on a uh, left downwind for runway 18 right. And it looks like we got a Baron out there as well that snuck over the top. Continue, keep your speed up, please. Follow the railroad tracks right downwind, runway 27, rock your wings, please, for the Baron. All right, good rock. You're ahead of that traffic now. Go ahead and descend down to 1,800 feet. Right down, went inside the gravel pit monitor tower on 118.5. All right, have that uh, traffic out there. There we go. There's that one out there. Yeah, make sure you keep that gravel pit off of your left side. There you go, keeping it off of your left side. You can start that descent now for runway 27. For my, it looks like a baron out there on the downwind. Give me a wing rock, baron. Let me see that wing. Let me see a good wing rock out of you. Good rock. Good job. All right. Yep. Keeping that gravel pit. There you go. Just off that left side. 
I want you to turn your base of the orange dot, land on or after the green dot for my Baron is on the down. Coming up the railroad tracks, make sure you fly directly over those railroad tracks, keeping it at 1,800 until you turn the downwind. As you're on the downwind, I want you to keep the gravel pit off of the left side. Most of you will be aiming for the orange, landing on or after the green unless it's being otherwise. My Baron should be in this space now. Baron, turn base, turn base, turn base. I don't want you to square it off. I want you to keep that turn coming all the way around. There you go. You got a little wide on me on my Baron. Keep the turn coming, dog leg turn all the way around. Aim for that orange dot, but land on or after the green dot. Just keep that turn coming all the way around. Wow, Looks like I've got a diamond on the downwind. Rocky wing for me, diamond. Uh, red and gray diamond on the downwind. Let me see a wing rock out of you. Good rock. And let's you turn your base at the orange dot. Turn your base at the orange dot and land on or after the green dot. As everybody's coming up the railroad tracks, make sure you stay directly over those railroad tracks, 1,800, and so you get on the downwind. Once you're on the downwind, get that descent coming in. It's going to be a close-in base to file for runway 27. Diamond, you're looking great. That's exactly what I want to see right there on that base turn. Again, on or after that green dot, you are clear to land. If you're on the downwind, I want you to make sure you're keeping that gravel pit off of your left side. Off the left side, don't go past the gravel pit. It's hard for us to see you out there. Most of you are going to be aiming for the orange, landing on or after the green dot, unless I tell you otherwise. Red and silver, silver Cirrus, three mile five, two seven. Red and silver Cirrus, runway two seven, clear to land on or after the green dot. All right, I got a long easy on the downwind. Rock your wings for me, long easy. Right past the gravel pit there. Let me see the good rock. Good right. wing rock <clears> out <throat> of you. I'm actually going to tell you when to turn your base. I don't want you to turn right at the orange. I've got a spirit coming in straight in on an IFR. I will tell you when to start your base, but I think once you're in the descent for my long easy, you should be coming on down in that descent for me. All right, for my two guys on the runway, you guys did a great job. Left or right into the grass and follow the flag, man. Welcome to the show. Okay, sounds good. Big Fork, Mill Earth Bay. Big Ford, all right, continuing down on the right base. Right base, Big Ford. All right. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Oshkosh, uh, the Pilot Edge Simbent Show 2024. We uh, did two approaches, one uh, for runway 18 right over Fisk Avenue. And then we did a uh, departure from 18 left after a short parking and uh, went out over to Green Lake and came back in um, over Ribbon and Fisk or towards Fisk. And then had to continue on the uh, railroad tracks for runway 27 and turn our uh, turn base on the uh, orange dot landed on the green dot. This is absolutely so much fun. It is. Just the single most fun thing you can do in this simulator. Uh, I think quite nervous starting this whole thing. Um, so many pages in that no time. You have to uh, to to be uh, sure you you know everything. Once you get in the air, it's uh, it's pretty pretty straightforward actually. It's um it's a lot of fun. A lot of planes, a lot of guys and girls out there uh, participating, which is uh, really, really cool to see. I really had a lot of fun. I've been uh, doing this for uh, two hours uh, on day two now. Missed out on uh, day one, unfortunately, but I think I will be starting up from Oshkosh again tomorrow on day three for some more fun. I hope you enjoyed. If you liked the video, then press that like button and uh, consider subscribing because uh, Sneaky the Pilot is definitely not done with flying. So, yeah. Come along for the ride. See you soon. Bonus footage. <laughs> Watching uh, Big Ford departing. Once on the downwind, start the descent. Keep that gravel pit off of your left side on that downwind. We're going to have you turning your base towards the orange dot, landing on or after the green dot. Unless I tell you otherwise, that's what most of you will do. Looks like joining the downwind, I've got a Cirrus. Cirrus joining the downwind. Rock your wings for me. Cool. Put wing rock on the Cirrus. <laughs> Very yeah, cool. Okay, thanks for watching. Yes. Ooh, there you go. Good rock on that. Good rock. There you go. On the down one again. Keep that D thing coming. I want you to turn your base at the orange dot. Land on or after the green dot. Two seven more clear land.